I first start out by tracing my pattern onto a sheet of cardboard. After I cut out my cardboard pattern, I then start hot gluing the aluminum foil to it on both sides, building it up as I go along. After I have the armature looking how I want it to, I then start spreading on the homemade paper mache clay. Just spread it on, make sure you cover all the uh, aluminum foil and get it, try to get it as smooth as possible. After I get the head and body completely covered with the paper mache clay, I let it dry completely before I lay it on its back and start spreading it on the bottom. Make sure you spread it smooth and evenly on the bottom so it doesn't wobble when you stand it up. And make sure it's completely dry before you do stand it up. After I'm done spreading the uh, paper mache clay and everything is dry, I then use the uh, Scopy air dry clay to build up the face, the head, the hair, and other parts of the body. To smooth out the body, I apply a thin layer of drywall compound. Just use the cheapest kind you can get. Uh, don't use DAP because apparently that's not going to work very well. After I apply the drywall compound, I let it dry and then I use a rag. I get it wet with some water and I wring it out a little bit so it's damp and then I just start rubbing down the drywall compound. This is what you do instead of sanding. For areas that uh, didn't quite come out as smooth as I wanted to, I just use some Sculpey Air Dry Clay and spread it on there and smooth it out that way. I wasn't completely satisfied by the way I did the mouth, so using the Air Dry Clay, I went and made another one. Make sure when you use air dry clay that you wet your fingers a little bit and surface and the clay that you're using. After I have everything as smooth as I want it and looking the way I want it, I then just uh, apply a couple coats of acrylic gesso. After I'm done applying two coats of acrylic gesso, I let it dry, then I start using acrylic craft paint to paint the rest of the body and the face and all the features. And here she is, looking good with Mr. Claus. You see I added a pair of granny glasses that I made from craft wire. So if you like this video, give it a thumbs up and please subscribe and have a great day and I'll see you next time.